everybody i'm hoping you are doing okay i am doing well by the grace of the lord our god i thank the lord for another day if you are new here special welcome unto you i am so glad that you are here to fill you in this is a platform whereby i'm sharing my simple city lifestyle experiences as i'm growing up to my 40s and i also do some sit downs uh, that is me focusing on legal things that i value as the lord grants me another day if you are keen to see how that turns out, how I pull out the lessons, how I mess up, how I learn, please do subscribe and tune in until the end. I also want to remind people out there, please watch the video until the end. So today guys, I'll be going to church to attend a Bible study sessions. I recently started um, attending a Bible study sessions. I started round about when June was about to end. This will be my second time going there. I went the first time and the second time I skipped and then the third time went. When I went there, I had something in mind. I had a sort of a picture in mind on how it's going to go about in terms of like, uh, I was expecting people to just be sitting in a circle or sitting somehow whereby it will enable them to be able to to be able to be in a discussion form, you know, um, indulge in the word, discuss the word, uh, share and confess if one feels like confessing, uh, praying together, asking some questions. So I had that in mind. And when I got there, I got a different setup. I got a different setup, but it was okay. It was okay. I did fit in, you know, I, because when I came out of the house, kind of revived and motivated about life things about my life i don't want to lie when i when i met with the my sisters and brothers in christ so yeah it was okay so i thought okay let me just keep on attending because yeah it kind of motivates me because i don't like people i'm a big fan of a interaction when it comes to worldly word things like when it comes to things related to the bible i believe in interaction i believe in like us talking getting to an understanding but not forcing each uh, not forcing our beliefs on each other because i believe also in a matter of in a word called a choice a matter of choice or willingness from a person. If you have told somebody something and they don't go along with the with, with it, they've got certain belief when it comes to whatever that you guys are speaking about. I don't believe in like trying to force, trying to be right and all that. I, I believe when it's being said and discussed and it came to a, a understanding from all of us, you know, if I believe it, it, it's okay, it's okay. So with me saying this, I am taking you with guys because I, I, I kind of uh, show the word it's about the word of God. 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 It's about. So it's more like about the word of God. I just want to show what's being shared in terms of like the word of God, and not only, and also remind not only to just see what is shared, as I'll be showing you in the video, guys, but to also uh, reference it to the word of God. Take your Bible, see what is shown there that it's in your Bible, you know. Is I believe in direct access when it comes to uh, when it comes to God because we have been given a direct access uh, by Christ Jesus when we believed in Christ Jesus when Christ Jesus died for us you know we were able to interact with God we became we became adopted sons of God the Father so we are able now to just form a relationship with him and that is done through the word of god that is done through listening to the word of god which is you get to uh, have your bible read the word of god not only listen to what the other person is saying not only to listen to a human reasoning but listen to what god exactly says when it comes to the word of God because there are many things said out there there are many things yeah there are many things I don't want to get into details but there are many things so I strongly want to advise people to indulge in the word of God themselves not only to hear from pastor not only to hear from a friend not only to hear from anyone hear and reference and pray about it I strongly advise that so I am that girl who believes in that way here 
and i know when people when you get to share about uh, godly things people get to judge you get to judge your lifestyle and whatever but i also want to remind, remind people out there that god is love god is love whatever you're going through whatever situation that you are in and with your own power you cannot take yourself out of it the word of god declares that um, we cannot make ourselves right by him by our own human efforts it is true faith in christ jesus that we get to be right by god so just have faith in christ jesus just be in prayer and ask god to help you in your parents and ask god to take you out of that situation and ask god to see through your heart that this is bothering you i don't want to be like this but i want to be something more i want to be a good person ask be sincere to god god knows your heart God knows us. He formed us, by the way. He formed us. We cannot fool him in any way. He formed us, by the way. So God, but so God knows us. So just go to God directly and be sincere to him and block all the noise when it comes to judgment. I know it's hard. I know it from me. I'm a sensitive being. I believe myself as being a sensitive being. I'm sensitive to whatever that is said about me and you know, I don't want to get details I don't want to get into details about me because I want to strongly like uh, put the message out there about God not me no I believe that one gets to survive in this world through God because it's God it's God who created everything it's God who created you he knows you best if you don't want to get lost go to the one who created the manufacturer so yeah guys I'm a strong believer comes to that I'm a strong believer when it comes to a relationship with God and I didn't this didn't come from my head I was also helped by the grace of the Lord when he chose people to unveil his messages to me back then and it's still happening now and I am slowly getting to understand things that way out the way I was not understanding that I was not a way of you know that I was seeing somehow you know because yeah I can be somehow I can be just a messy person I can be just ooh, a person or oh, wrong or oh, wrong but what I'm saying God's grace is keeping me uh, in place God's grace is helping me to live God's grace is helping me to smile today so guys enough with the talking I'll see you guys later please tune in until the end I'll greatly appreciate if you support by tuning in until the end uh, Watch the video until the end. Give it a like. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Yeah, see you later.